thought I was dead, didn't you? What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the Beastly Gamer channel. I know, let's not talk about how long it's been since I made a video because I know it's been a long time. But something recently happened in my life and I wanted to kind of uh, talk about two things. First of all, things have changed quite a bit in my life uh, since the last time I made a video. I have gone and gotten officially hitched. I, I married Kate after all these years. We've been together 10 years. Gave her a dream wedding. Bought her a new car. Treated her like a man who loves a woman. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, I'm effectively broke, that's why I gotta start making videos. No, I'm just kidding. Um, something happened recently at work. As you guys know, I own a business and I run a laboratory uh, in downtown Georgia, and or downtown Atlanta. And um, my my uh, place of employment recently changed insurance providers. We were we were with ADP, um, which a lot of people use. You might use it yourself. And we recently switched over to a company called CoAdvantage. So uh, this new insurance company. Provides us, you know, with quite a bit of substantial savings, and uh, I actually like some of the things that they added and gave us the option for. Like now, I have like fraud prevention, and I'll get a text or an email if someone tries to open an account in my name. It's pretty cool what Code Co Advantage can do for you. Uh, but something else happened that caused me to kind of rush and, and spend quite a bit of money. There's something with ADP that I had called uh, FSA or flexible spending accounts. These are accounts that uh, you um, you put a certain amount of money in once you sign up, and it comes out of your paycheck throughout the course of a year. So if I wanted two thousand dollars in my flexible spending account or twenty five hundred dollars in my flexible spending account, uh, it it is paid out over the course of my paychecks throughout the year. And uh, last year I had flexible spending, and I think I lost thirteen hundred dollars because at the end of the year, whatever you have left, it all disappears except for five hundred dollars. So I put 2,500 in last year, spent a little bit. I had uh, um, 1,800, I lost 1,300, and I had 500 left. So at the beginning of this uh, fiscal year, I only put $300 in because I didn't want to lose the 500 I had, and just in case I needed more, uh, I put 300 more in. So I had $800 in my flexible spending account. So with my FSA, I thought it was good, but now that we switched over to a new insurance provider, bad news for Beasley, I had to use all that flexible spending uh, before the end of the month. Here we are in May. Today's the 22nd. I had to the end of the month to use all $800. I wish I'd known about this last year. So when the, uh, when the co-advantage um, representative came to my office uh, and explained to us what we need to do, he gave me a website. I didn't even know this website existed. It's called fsastore.com. And I went to the FSA store and I spent my $800 and I wanted to show you guys what I got. But specifically today, I'm going to review a product that I actually need right now. So let's check out the haul. <sighs> okay, so first things first. I am a man, I'm a husband and a father. So what does any smart man do first? You, you buy things for your, your lady. Make sure she has the stuff that she wants. So I went and uh, bought some stuff for Kate. First things first, I got her something called a Caring Mill uh, heating pad. Because Kate, she gets these muscle aches and stuff like that. And so this was on the FSA store as well. Bought her this, so that's going to be something that probably I'll use at some point in the future as well. Um, I got her a spot acne treatment. So this thing right here, it uses light. You shine it on your face and it's supposed to um, alleviate issues with acne. When Kate was young, she had acne. She doesn't anymore, but she still has lingering memories of it. Okay, the rest of the stuff I got for Kate is I got her a lavender relaxation mask. That woman looks like she's sleeping back. Um, and so you can microwave it for soothing moist heat or chill it for a cooling compress. So yeah, the kind of stuff that women like, you know what I'm saying? I also got her, because she likes lavender, apparently, a lavender comfort wrap. All this stuff is on the FSA store. I spent 800 bucks. And so this is microwave for soothing moist heat or chill for a cooling compress. So she can be hot or cold if she wants, however she chooses now. Let's see. Got her, I don't know what this is. 
I don't know. Oh, it's Nausea Relief Jewelry. Oh, this is, uh, it's called Bristlets, and it's a bracelet that somehow alleviates nausea. And that's science. I'm sure that they do their thing. I don't know. It costs like $30 per bracelet. And so she wanted that. I got her some Australian gold lip balm. I just, I had to spend all my money. So I got like a couple of these. I think I got four of these. And I got her, for her little tiny pretty feet, some Dr. Scholl's Tri Comfort uh, foot insert insoles. So. So now, you know, when she's walking around the house, homeschooling the kids or walking out to the backyard and getting in the pool, her feet don't hurt. Now let's see what the beast got for himself. So I, uh, Amazon has an FSA store too. I think I spent just maybe a hundred dollars with Amazon uh, because the FSA store gave me a lot less hassle. When you go to Amazon and you go to the Amazon FSA store, they'll have a whole bunch of stuff that you can buy. When you start buying it, it says, no, you can't buy it. You gotta use your credit card or your debit card. So. Amazon is a little bit more troublesome than the FSA store. And there'll be a link below for you guys if you have a flexible spending account. That way you can just buy the stuff you need. So, now this one, this is not what I'm reviewing today. I'll use this as another, at another time. This is the Neil Med Singulator Cordless Pulsating Nasal Wash. Don't ask me why, but you know, even right now, I'm congested. It's like I can't even breathe, man. Maybe I work in a lab and working it around chemicals too long. But I opened up this box yesterday to see what was in it. I haven't used it at all. And so this is kind of um, the much cheaper version of, well, not much. I think it was $60, 50 or 60 bucks. I might be wrong. I can't remember. I was using my FSA, so I can't, couldn't remember how much it was. But it wasn't as much as a Nazaj thing that I bought, or Navage, whatever it's called. So this is... um something I'll be trying out later and that way I'll have two of these type of devices and I'll be able to see which one's best. I also got <laughs> don't don't kill me for this. I got six boxes of this nasal spray. It seems like I have a nose fetish, but it's like there's only so many things you can buy. You know, I I didn't want to buy a ton well I did buy bandages. I bought something like this I bought something like uh, this for my kids too. I bought my kids a little electric nose cleaner for like little kids that plays baby tunes and stuff because these are the kind of things you can get you can get you know glasses and things like that but i don't wear glasses so I, it's nose and band-aids and feet so that's what fsa is all about so i've got six boxes of this the x clear or x clear nasal spray which is basically a sugar called xylitol with saline and you spray it up in your nose and it's supposed to be like a nasal spray i used this already yesterday and I couldn't really detect if it was much better than the stuff I pay for at Kroger or, or even I, I don't even know if it worked as well I think the stuff at Kroger probably works a lot more but it's probably much worse for you this is 100% natural um, and so I'll probably switch over to these I got six packages of it so it'll, I'll be on this at least for about two years so as you can see there's a lot of stuff on my table I mean, there's a lot of stuff, and some of it, <laughs> you know what to say when I show it to you, so I want to save the, the juicier stuff for the end. So let's start with my Dr. Scholl's Foot Comfort Insoles. This doesn't look like it's big enough for my foot. We'll see. I got another one from Amazon that's actually in my work boot right now. So this looks like it's for 8 to 12. I'll wear a size 14 shoe. Wink. Um, I got the One Touch... Where is it at? I got the One Touch Ultra Blood Glucose Monitoring System. Um, and this is just to monitor your blood sugar and to make sure you're in a healthy zone. This is super expensive. That was $100 right there. Just for those. 50 of these um, test strips. And so I just wanted something that I could possibly be using in the future. Um, I'm not a diabetic. I don't have any issues with my heart or anything like that. But um, I think that stuff like this will probably be good to have in the future as you get older. You know, I'm 40 years old. I got, because I have, I have children on. I have five kids. And Kate always wanted one of these. We just never bought one. We always used the one that goes under your arm or in your mouth or other places. So we got a forehead thermometer. That's right. I can see your your temperature from a distance. Just see me aiming across the room. Boom, 96. And that's what I'll be doing. Also, uh, my wife likes to make sure our kids are healthy all the time. So 
that takes kind of the fun out of just aiming lasers across the room. Speaking of keeping the kids safe, I got two boxes of 150 bandages um, because I don't want them to get hurt, but if they do, they need to definitely take care of themselves. Um, ooh, Boogie Mist. It's a natural saline mist for stuffy noses. It's always about the nose in the Beastly House. And so this is something that I got from... Uh, the FSA store, and it's safe for children. So if my kids get, you know, clogged up, they can spray it on up there and they'll be straight to go. I got more of this Australian gold. So now I'll see what Kate did. She kept two for herself and gave me two because she loves me. So those go in my box. All right. Oh, an another boogie mist for the kids. Keeping those nose clean around here. Noses. Okay. I'll save that for a second. Okay, um, I got a portable steam inhaler. Why not? It's made by Vix. It's the name you trust. Vix and shit. So I got a Vix portable steam, steam inhaler for those days that you just feel like inhaling warm tufts of air. And see, right now I really could use it because I'm kind of congested. I swear I am. I got, oh, what is this? Echotherapy pain relief. Two standard pads, one pair. I don't know what this is. Pain relief experts for 20 years. It's from a company called Omron. It's the electrotherapy pain reliever. I don't know how much it costs. It looks expensive, probably 100 or so dollars uh, to relieve pain. Yes, so I'm going to be pain free. I don't know how this works. Oh, what's in that? Oh, I did get myself a lavender mask. I got myself a mask, and for me, it's just for sleep, just for sleep. I don't want to microwave, and I don't want to freeze it. Who wants to sleep with an ice cube on her face anyway? And who wants to sleep with a hot-ass face? Just give me a regular face, cover my eyes. I, I, I need earplugs with this, because I have a house full of children. Good sleep. It smells like lavender. Okay, I got the Vix Sinus in <laughs> Inhalador. That's the Spanish uh, term for nasal inhaler. Let me see. Do I have it the wrong? Oh, I was just, I was looking at the Spanish side. Si habla espanol. It's called the sinus inhaler. And it's 99.99% .99 of germs free steam. So uh, it kills all the germs in your nose. Fast relief helps alleviate congestion from allergies and colds. Easy. 5 to 15 minute treatment. Bam! Don't know if I'll be using this anytime soon, but just in case, I'll be breathing clear. I know you guys are like, man, this dude's going to have to... Every time I breathe, it's going to sound like this. <laughs> My nose is going to be clear as hell. Alright, so this is the big boy. This is what I'm going to actually be using today. So you guys are going to... Hang with me to see this. Comes in a, in a baggie. So this hair is the Navage Nasal Care. And this is the, I got the premium edition, so I guess it comes with a plastic bag. And so basically, it has everything you need to get started. Fast drug-free re, drug relief from allergies and sinus congestion. Powered suction. So it's going to suck, it's going to suck my nose. That's some freaky stuff. I'm really excited to see what's in the box. Um, so it comes with, wow. It comes with 18 of these little clear containers with, uh, there's salt pods. 18 saline concentrate capsules for nasal irrigation. That sounds scientific. It also has, uh, this doodad here, it looks like like an uh, attachment for a steam iron. I don't know what that is. I do suppose I'll be finding out. Uh, comes with, um, oh, it's the countertop caddy. Oh, snap. That's for the countertop. So I can just leave it on the counter so people walk into my bathroom and go, ooh, that looks clean. Boogers everywhere. Uh, oh, and I get nine more salt pods. So I guess the extra little bit of money for this was worth it because there's salt everywhere. And so yeah, this thing, I've seen a few videos on it. People swear by it. And if it's as good as I've seen in videos, I'm going to be sleeping like a baby tonight, tonight. Okay, so as you may have noticed, there's a couple things left on the table. 
Maybe you can't see them. Um, and this is the freaky stuff. And it, this one was truly an accident. I was making a joke. My son just went to prom, uh, Beastly Jr. Uh, he'll be 18 in a couple of days. He's dating like one of the smartest kids in the school. And uh, they're both, you know, they both got accepted to college. She got a full ride. He just got accepted. And I was talking about him while I was on the FSA store. And I came across these. And I, I swear to God, I don't remember clicking to add to cart. But, you know, when you have like 20 things in the cart, you don't look at them all. You just say, I want to spend my $800 before it disappears. So I accidentally got Royal Premium Lubricated Strawberry Condoms. He's almost 18. My son, you know, he's a virgin. He's a big dude, just like his dad. And so I wanted to be protected, so I'm trying to find out the best way to maybe slip these two in on the low. You know what I'm saying? Also, what else do I got here? I saw them. I read some reviews on it. This is strictly, strictly for medical purposes only. I got some surgical lubricant and sterile as well. Look at that. Let's see. Uh, see how... Oh, it's, it's, it's completely closed. It is sterile. But yeah, uh, I saw some really colorful reviews on this stuff. And I was like, well, what could this be used for? Maybe uh, lubricating maybe the inside of a person's nose when they're using the, the navage. Or maybe, um, you know, under your eyes or something if you just feel like they won't open. Maybe you blink and maybe put some super glue in your eyeballs or something. This might come in handy. And that's why I bought three of them. Also... That's about it. That's it. That's eight hundred dollars worth of stuff from the FSA store, and I'm going to go use the Navage right now. Who's ready to see some some mucus flowing? I guess let's go do it, people. What's going on, guys? Welcome to the Beast of Gamer Channel. Today I will be doing a review of the Navage Nasal Care System, Saline Nasal Irrigation System. Uh, this thing was about a hundred and twenty dollars, I do believe. Uh, bought it on the FSA store, and I've heard a lot about this thing. And I'm one of those people that, in the middle of the night, I wake up and I'm congested. I have such a big head that a lot of thoughts coagulate inside of it. And even right now, you know, I got off work maybe an hour and a half ago. I'm driving home and pollen, all this stuff, just it just builds up inside my big biscuit. So I've been really looking forward to trying this thing out. The box is very pretty. It just looks like a clean nose. It says, the Navage Nasal Care Saline Nasal Irrigation System. Everything you need to get started. Now this thing did come with quite a few extra salt pots. Uh, and it has a quick start guide here. I'll read it to you. It says, getting started is super easy. We've installed the battery, so all you have to do is Attach the nasal dots. Let's take the device out first. Let's see what this thing looks like. All right. So we've got. Let's get this plastic bag open. Ooh, that looks painful. I hope this is not something I have to stick in my nose. Um, I think that goes inside the nose. Ooh, I can't wait to use this thing. I'm so excited. Um, here it is, the Navage, the Navage. I'm sorry if I sound stopped up, that's why I'm doing this review. Let's get this thing out. Okay, two-stage power button. See owner's manual for details. I don't want to do all that right now. Uh, exploded view. Oh, wow, so they just kind of exploded it and showed what it looks like. All right, so first things first, you have to attach this bad boy. Oh my goodness. Is that upside down, is it? Oh man. I'm scared. It looks like it has power now. Okay. Fill the upper tank with water to the fill line. Okay, so where's the fill line at? Oh, it says fill line right there. I don't know if you can see it. All right, so. We're going to fill this thing up with water right now. And we're filled with water. All right. Next thing is place a new unused salt pod capsule into the crushing chamber. What the world is a crushing chamber? 
might I ask? All right, so I got the um, the DLC version of this uh, Mirage. I got a total of 45 of these things. There's 18 in here. There's 18 inside the extra pack, and then there was nine more. So um, I'll, I'll be clean nose and breathing clear for weeks, months, hopefully. All right, so let's open this up. Now, um, this thing only works with the Navage salt pods, too. I'm so happy you guys are here with me for this scary stuff. I'm afraid. Okay, so it says, um, place a new salt pod in the crushing chamber, foil side down. So here's the crushing chamber. This little area here, I would, because it's shaped like the uh, salt pod. Salt pod required. It says it right on the top. Okay. Oh man. So when you crush it, I just got salt in my mouth. That would be good with my steak later on. Close the lid firmly until you hear it click shut. Do not open. Okay, this button only works when a new salt pod is in the crushing chamber. Chamber. Press firmly. Oh, okay. Let me. Are you guys ready to do this, man? I'm ready to do it. <laughs> All right. There's the power button there. I'm pretty good at that. See my controller behind me. Oh God. Press firmly. It already has the batteries installed. Oh my God. For safety and effect, I'm trying to read everything. I'm scared. Weird thing, this sucks my brain out. Oh, it's working. Oh my god. Let's try to get some light in here. There's a lot of junk in there. Oh. It's all floating around. I still got water in my nose. There's a lot of junk in there. I'm going to go and get this water out of my nose and I'll be right back. Okay, this thing is awesome. Uh, after I did it, I stood around for a few seconds, and I was like, my nose still feels a little, a little congested. Maybe it didn't work as well. And then after about 45 seconds, it all completely cleared up. You hear that? Can you smell that? That salty goodness? Uh, this thing is a little a little off-putting because you can see everything that comes out of your nose but as it sits right now i really 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 like this thing now um don't forget i still have this one which i've never tried the singulator uh the, the sinew gator these people come up with these crazy names and i'll be trying this one out probably in another day or two but as it sits right now um the navage works very well i like it a lot you guys let me know what you think about the Navage nasal irrigation system. Um, I feel like I'm really nasty just holding tufts of boogers. That's literally what it is, tufts of boogers, you see it? They're all staying together too, they're friends. I feel really good. My nose is clear. It was a little scary at first, but I think I want to have a lot of good times with this Navage. You guys give a thumbs up, show support for the channel. It's been a long time. I've been playing a lot of um, video games wise. I've been playing, of course, The Last of Us. I'll never stop. And I've been playing um, World War Z, which is awesome. It's it's like Left 4 Dead, Left 4 Dead's 
younger brother who grew up and got bitter graphics and went to third person. It's sick. You guys need to be playing that. But give a thumbs up. Show support for my channel. I'm so happy to be here with you guys. Thank you for hanging through this. I know it was a long video, but it was a lot to talk about. Marriage. My son went to the prom. My son graduated. My son's going to college. And my nose is clear. I'm the Beastly Gamer. And I'll see you guys next time.